Let me show you how to design a poster in Adobe Photoshop. Let's start by creating a new file, size 21 by 29.7 centimeters. Drag this image into Photoshop. You'll find the download link in the description below. Now go to Adjustment Layer and choose Solid Color. Let's choose this blue color. You can check the code right here. Change the blending mode to color. Let's delete the background layer. Unlock it and delete it. Choose the solid color layer. Now drag the car layer to Photoshop. We're gonna add a shadow right under the car. Let me show you how it's done. Let's create a new layer right here. Set the foreground color to black. Now grab the brush tool and pick the soft round brush. Set the opacity to 100% and lower the fill a bit. And just follow along with this process. You can get Photoshop from the link in the description below. You can reduce the fill a bit if you want. Select the car layer, then drag the smoke image into Photoshop. Go ahead and rotate it like this, then place it right here. Just follow along with the process. Change the blending mode to screen. Let's fix its position. Follow along with the steps. Now once again, click on the car layer. Press Ctrl J to make a copy, then drag that copied layer right below the original one. Go to Filter. Blur Gallery. Choose Path Blur. Just follow along with these steps. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. When you finish, press OK. All right, we need to hide these parts. Just add a mask, pick the brush tool, make sure black is your foreground color, and start painting over the spots you want to remove. Now it's time to add the text and the logo. I've already set them up, so I'll show you the font and the sizes I used for all the text. You can find the logo in the description below. Just select the Type tool and type out these words. Then let's open the Character panel to adjust the settings. This is the font that I'm using. You can find all the fonts and the images in the description below. Now let's check the smaller text font and size. Follow along these settings. If you have any questions, write them below and I will reply to you as soon as possible. Now we're going to add another subtitle down here. I'll also show you the font I used for it. This is the font that I'm using. Follow these settings. Select the line tool. Set the stroke color to white. And the size to 0.5 pixels. Make sure there's no fill color. Now draw a line like this. Reduce the fill. Next, add a layer mask. Pick the gradient tool, set it to black and white, and use it to hide this part of the line, like so. Now hold Alt and drag the line to the right to make a copy. Go to Edit, Transform, and choose Flip Horizontal. Then just adjust its position and place it right over here. Now for the last part, let's add a paragraph of text down here. I'll show you the font I used for it. If you have any questions, write them below, and I will reply to you as soon as possible. That's it. Hope you liked it.
You can get all my Photoshop and Illustrator files on my Patreon page for a small subscription fee. Join now. Link in the description. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tutorials. Also watch other tutorials in my channel.